guys, it's Leisha and welcome back to my channel. A while back, like a real while back, I did a story on Instagram and asked you guys if you would ever like to see my complete collection of book snuggies. And you said yes. So uh, today I'm going to be showing you all of my book sleeves that I currently own. I have book sleeves or book snuggies um, from two different stores. I have them from a very, very dear friend of mine who doesn't really make them much anymore since so she had a baby. And then I have a couple from The Cozy Life. So I'm just going to jump right in and go ahead and show you all of my book sleeves. I love book sleeves so much uh, and they've saved my life on multiple occasions and my mother's life since she ruins books all the time so we bought her one for Christmas a couple years ago. And I've gotten quite a few people hooked on them because they're amazing and everybody should have them. I'm going to go ahead and do these sleeves from uh, The Cozy Life first. So the first one I have is this gorgeous map print. This is one of my favorite prints that I have. I love it so, so much and it goes with a ton of my historical books because I like to try and match my sleeves with my book that I'm reading. And this one is definitely one that I grab often because it matches a lot of my books. The next one that I have, and the last one that I have from The Cozy Life, is my most recent, most recent sleeve purchase. I haven't purchased them in a while, and that's kind of sad. But it is this camper sleeve. It's like these vintage campers, and I love, love, love it. These are all from my very good friend Lee at White Teepee Designs on Etsy. I will be linking both of these shops down in the description box below so that you guys can check them out if you'd like to. This was the first book sleeve I ever got and the one that really started my obsession. And that is this Beauty and the Beast print and it is the stained glass image from like the start of the movie. The next one I have is this Firefly print, or lightning bug, depends on what you call them and where you're from. We love them, we get them here in Indiana in the summer, and that is one thing that I love about the summer, and one thing I look forward to is when the fireflies, or lightning bugs, come out. But I had, had, had to get this print. So stinking cute. And one thing I love about Lee's sleeves, she uses a different print inside the sleeves and on the outside. So the outside is where your print is but you also get a little uh, snippet of a different print up at the top and also the inside of the book sleeve. I use this cover all the time especially in the spring. It is this gorgeous bike with a basket of flowers and I grab this cover constantly because I love it so much. And it is this peach with like leaves type cover and it's got this contrasting teal, but the fabric has gold polka dots on it. So perfect and I love it. She said she went to the fabric store just for me and saw this print and knew that I needed it because uh, I was super bright and cheery. I don't know if my family would always agree, but this is definitely one that I grab uh, when it's bright outside, but also when it's a little, a little gloomy and I need a little sunshine because it is a super bright a uh, flower print with peach and then it's got a super bright yellow inside and I love this one so so much. This one is this gorgeous succulent print and I love this one so much. I'm surprised my sister hasn't stolen it from me yet because uh, succulents are her favorite. Can I just say so I don't have to say it anymore. I love all of my book covers. I love them a lot. The next one, again, I'm surprised my sister hasn't taken it from me, is this succulent one. Super, super, super cute. And then it has this contrasting polka dot taupe lining. The next one is this coffee print with a contrasting blue uh, fabric up top. This is one that goes out a lot with the books that I uh, lend out. Very rare that I lend out books, but when I do, I am like take a snuggie, like take a sleeve with you, protect it, and you know that this book comes back to me in this snuggie. Next one I have is this really fun skull and floral print. It is very rustic and then it has a pink polka dot trim and inside. And my only 
problem with this one and uh like this is just me nitpicking is the logo her logo is in bright pink on this one all her other logos are white um but the pink is just so bright pink that's not taking anything away from the snuggie it's this cow print and it has a contrasting like a uh, blue bandana paisley type fabric fun fact alicia loves cows like a lot i always kind of wanted a cow this is a cover i grab all the time because i read a lot of western historicals and quite a few contemporaries that have cowboys in it the last snuggie i'm going to show you is one that again i grab all the time pictures to hold on it's um probably one of my favorites it was actually a custom one done for me i asked lee to see if she could like look around and find this print for me and if she would if she would make me one and she did she loves me so much and i love her so much and i'm so thankful for this snuggie and it is this horse head print i love it i have 13 book snuggies or book sleeves in total and trust me this pile is always growing i'm always finding new ones that i cannot live without they are life savers because you can throw your book in here and throw it in your bag take it around and never have to worry about it getting messed up and if you can find somebody whose work you really 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 love honestly it's an amazing way to support a small business and get something that is so useful and bookish and looks real cute sitting on your bookshelf so yeah i hope you guys enjoyed that video and seeing my collection of book snuggies or book sleeves whatever you call them if you have a collection of them from a different company that you love 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 leave it in the comment section below i would love to find a new company um i love supporting small businesses when i can especially when i get such a good thing out of it you can go ahead and check out these lovely 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 ladies on their etsy shops again those will be in the description below and while you're at it, while you're online, you can check out my Instagram where you see quite a few of these. And you can follow me at For the Love of Christian Fiction. And you can also check out my blog, For the Love of Christian Fiction .com. And all my other links are also in the description box below. You can check them all out. And I think that's it. I'll see you guys later. Bye.